guys welcome back to my channel i hope everybody's having a great day today today i want to share my dollar tree haul with you guys so let's get right into this so i picked up i was in the food section i found another can of the unico diced tomatoes these are great i made a really small spaghetti sauce the other day and i thought these are per this was perfect i love that it's a click top and these were really, really good. So I was really happy to, that I picked this up rather than the great big can. So this is, I'm gonna repurchase these the next time I see them again. I also got this, this is just the Italian seasoning. Now I usually keep a different kind of Italian seasoning that I buy in the grocery store and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna give this a try. This is the Supreme Tradition Italian seasoning. I've never had it, I've never tried it, but hey, I'm gonna give that a whirl. Look at these adorable little cans for Easter. I think that's what they're calling them. Uh, yeah, well, it just is a little can, I guess. But look at this little dude. Oh, this little gnome is just adorable. I just think it's so cute. Look at it. It says, Happy Easter Egg Hunt. Oh, my gosh. You could just put little Easter eggs in here and set it out on your table. Or maybe even do some whip topping if you wanted to on here. Faux, fake whip topping. Just so cute. So, anyway, the possibilities are endless. And then I got this one. I'm in love with this one as well. Use it as a little planter even put a little fake succulent in there just so cute and this again says happy easter egg hunt uh, it says join the egg hunt with that cute little truck so you know what these are the only two can you see them these are the only two that i picked up and i think that they are just adorable i love them and then sit still in the easter section i love this so much like it's so cute happy easter look at the little wreath with the little eggs and then the side oh so i think i'm going to put some picks in here with some eggs on it and just some like nice spring flowers and just set it out i think it's really really cute i love it i really do um i picked this up for my husband just some of the big cheese uh the monk bad monkey it says big cheese uh this is the nacho cheese flavored we love it here so i just pick up another bag because sometimes i notice that they don't have them out as much anymore so or as many like the shelves aren't stocked up i guess is what i wanted to say i picked this up for my son's 30th birthday and this is just the really cute plastic table covers but I love the color and I picked up two of those to help me decorate for his birthday love 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 and he will love it as well and then I got these because I still have to put my little grandson's Easter baskets together and I thought oh I'll get this I think it's like, a, it's a nice pinkish kind of red color and it's nice and colorful for Easter. So they're just the basket bags, that's all these are. So I'll be putting something together for them if I can with this. And if not, I still have some of the white or the clear wrap, you know? So I picked up these two for that. We'll see how that goes. Oh, I was in the craft section and I found these and I was so happy. These are just the wood planks by Crafter Square. There's six in a pack, it just looks like that wonderful wonderful for crafting sending out flat mail when you create a little something while you're crafting it just it just wonderful i think then also these wood planks that i picked up these are really nice as well and there's six in here i picked up two of these you can do so much you could even make something with these by you know gluing them together making a little planter box almost just a little one just to keep in the house and put some flowers in there paint it make it look farmhousey put something on with your cricket on here just thinking of all the endless possibilities so i just picked up two of those to have to craft with oh i picked up a couple of these the icy the more it's icy squares i love these so we like to have them on hand whenever we want a little treat my husband really well i shouldn't either have them but we really do enjoy them um what else did i get oh for father's day for my son-in-law he is a football player so i and he loves football so i just picked those up for him i thought he would like them they're just by juncture just for men i think he would really really like these i think they're so cute and then i got this um i just think that these are beautiful now they had like a coral color a blue color a really nice blue actually a darker blue maybe and a gray but i got the plant this here is called a planter but look at how beautiful the scalloped edges are on here but i'm going to mention something to you guys when i grabbed these 
I noticed that some of them, the ends were really broken down. Like if you, it's not a really heavy plastic, but were pushed right in and some of them were broke. So I really had to look around to make sure I got two good ones, which I did. But look at the scalloped edges, but look at the nice, it's like a flower pattern going around here. I think that this is just beautiful. Again, you can do so much with this. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them yet, but you could even use it for storage or use it for whatever you want. I think that these are great, not just for planters. Um, the last thing that I'm going to show you guys, which I thought, oh my gosh, these are so cute. This is just the Crafter Square craft fabric. fabric. And I picked this up, not that I use fabric a lot whenever I'm crafting, but this is just the cutest. I think I'm gonna try and open it. No, I cannot. So this is just like the little truck. And I was like, oh my gosh, can you just see the little truck in there? Look at how cute that is. I love the color. The color is perfection of this truck. I love it. I love the red truck and I love the different color trucks, but I love this blue. Just It's like a Tiffany blue, just beautiful. And then I got this. So when you're crafting a little something, putting this on the in the background, gluing it down on one of your projects, look at this with the little cat looking at the little butterfly. Oh my goodness gracious. So I got that one. And the last one that I picked up is really just as cute. And look at this. <sighs> It's so beautiful, I couldn't resist. Although, I, I, I'm gonna keep it in my stash. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it right just yet. But look at that, look at that little kitty cat. Oh my gosh, and it's just looking at the little flowers. It's just adorable. It does say something though. It says, I didn't even notice this. It says, oh, boots and buckets. Boots and buckets of fun, I think. Boots boots and buckets. Oh, it's just so cute. So I was really, really happy to get that fabric. Look at that. I just think it's so adorable. So happy to get that. So let me look around. Oh no, I got a couple more things to show you guys. Actually, I picked up three of these all together. And again, they're going to go in my little grandson's little Easter baskets. I couldn't resist. So this says construction, and this is two pieces, die cast little metal excavators, I think you could call that, but look at that. So I know that my little Lincoln and River and Phoenix too, they will love this. This is a green briar potter, but these are really, really cute. You can hear my cat, Finn's bugging her. <laughs> so I picked up three of those all together for my little grandsons. I think that they would really love that included in their little Easter basket. Now I'm on the hunt to get them a couple, just one outfit each for their Easter basket, and then I am done. So I wanted to mention something really quick with you to you guys because I'm... I usually don't mention this stuff, but I was really excited. So last week, my husband took me away for the day and we landed up going, we ended up going out for supper and we landed at the casino here in Ottawa, Ontario. So while I was there, we were only there for 20 minutes. I got onto a machine and I just started playing it. I'd never played this particular machine before. So I was betting $2.50. About my third spin in, I hit the um, bonus round. So when I hit the bonus round, it gave me free spins and more free spins and more free spins. And then you had to fill this little, when these numbers come up, uh, or denominations of dollars came up, so many came up, you would go into another bonus round. So I did, and when I did, I filled this whole uh, little piece, like I can't really explain it. So. And then I heard the bells go off and this lady said to me, do you know what you just won? Because I was just sitting there waiting for the machine to count up. She said, do you know what you just won? I said, I think I won double my money, whatever it is that's on these coins that I won. She goes, no, you won the grand jackpot, which was 11,100, no wait, $11,716. I was so, I'm gonna put a picture at the end of this video of the picture that I had won. So I was like, oh my gosh, I was very emotional. I My husband came and I was still really emotional. And then I had, whenever they came to pay me out, I had to like, just take a little minute to breathe. I got off of the machine, they gave me my money and a check for so much of it and some cash. And then I just sat off to the side for a minute and I had to digest that because it was very emotional. Some people may think that that's not a lot of money, but to me, that's a lot of money all at once. And I never thought in a million years I would win something like that. So I was really, 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 
happy. Um, it was a lot of emotions all at once, but I wanted to share that with you guys because it was a very happy time in my life. So that is it for today. I'll put a picture of the machine that I went on um, at the end of this because uh, I did snap a quick picture of it whenever it was like counting up. So you'll see an amount in the corner. That's not the amount, but the, the you'll see a thing that says winner and it, it'll say how much I won. I was just so, so excited. So that is it for today, guys. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you guys soon. Bye, everybody. Thanks for joining me.